<laughs> Look at these squishies I got home. Look. Oh, Bebe, I love you. So I have this really awkward parting on this wig because um, yeah, I'm gonna cut it today. I'm gonna cut this wig. It's a lovely wig is from perfectlizwigs.com. You will find the information in the description box down below. I was supposed to upload this video so long ago. I just like totally misunderstood something. So now you're finally seeing this video. So you guys know I wanna cut it shorter because I think this is kind of an awkward length. It does look good now that it's flat iron, but I would like want it to around here to make it more of a look so that's what i'm doing today i'll probably totally fail but uh, i mostly want to have this wig curled so i hope it'll look good anyways even if like it's not totally straight this is the scissor i'm gonna use it's like the best scissor i have so that's what i'm using it's a, it's a scissor, it's a scissor. I also want to cut some bangs on this wig. That's kind of why I have this mid parting. In the first place, let's go. I'm cutting my wig in the viewfinder. Problem? Yes, actually there is kind of a problem with that. I'm just way too lazy to go up and get the mirror. Let's just like start, like yeah. Okay, it doesn't look too bad in the viewfinder. Okay, this is like roughly done. <laughs> I totally need to go to my bathroom mirror because I can't do this because I can't see the back. This is what you need hairdresser friends for. Wear mine. Ah. Let's just go to the other side now. I swear to God, if somebody tells me to donate the hair I cut off, I'm going to block you. Okay, it's looking like real ass cute, don't you think? I'm gonna do one of those discreet like see-through bangs, but let me go just fix this up a bit and I'll be back. So I'm back, I cut my hair. I think it looks amazing. Of course, it's not perfect, but I like it a lot. So that's good. That's the most important part. I've also wet down the wig a bit in the front so I can do the bangs. Of course, as you guys know, I don't want a thick bang. I think you've seen me do this. Like this is the third time and I probably am going to do this on my own hair too. So you'll probably see it a fourth. <laughs> Okay, so it's uh, kind of done. <clears throat> I need to style it. I'll be back tomorrow, I guess, with the finished wig. Ooh. So it's been a couple of days, so I've noticed that it looks amazing if you put some water in it, do a little bit like this, and then once it's dry, it's gonna give itself some really luscious curls that are kind of wavy and not too curly. As you can see, I think it looks pretty nice. What do you guys think? Can you guys tell the look, what I'm going for here? Kind of a gothic Matilda from Leon the Professional. This has been my favorite wig for a long time now. So I love it. I hope you have liked it. You've seen it in one video so far, but, but everybody else has been telling me I look like either an Amish or like a monk. So I don't know. I still love the wig. I don't get how people can think that. Maybe it's because I'm way too into the like Korean scene. I don't think so. I think it looks super awesome, but maybe the people on town think I look like a maniac slash monk slash Amish, Amish. I think you guys get me. I hope, uh, I really hope for you at least. Somebody gets me and my vision here. So if you like this wig, give it a thumbs up. You'll find everything you need to know about the wig down in the description box below. And uh, thank you so much for watching. Thank you to Perfect Liz Wig for sponsoring me with this awesome wig. I've been wearing it all the time. Thank you. And so I hope I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I love you.